discrimination. Hello, uh, my name is Georgi Cholatze. Um, my, I'm come from Georgia. <laughs> nice reaction. Trichna. Um, you mentioned the you mentioned the crisis in uh, South Caucasus in my country. Uh, my question is related to this. Uh, are you going to uh, recognize the mistakes you made towards Georgia, and uh, how you are going to improve the relations towards Georgia or with Georgia if you are going to do? Thank you. Спасибо. Thank you. I will try to answer to you with utmost frankness, the way I understand it. First, I think the dramatic events that happened do not reflect the profound sympathy that the Russian people always felt for the Georgian people, and vice versa, as I trust. Neither do they reflect the historic decisions that were taken in the 18th and 19th centuries, when Russia, after all, helped the Georgian state come into being. Everything that happened, let me tell you utterly frankly, is on the conscience of Georgia's leaders. This is my direct and open position. I can tell you even more. When I became president of the Russian Federation, I had a meeting with Mr. Saakashvili and told him that we were ready to help with the restoration of the territorial integrity of his state. But for that, the right kind of behavior was needed. As I think you understand, military operations were never conducive to the strengthening of the state. A very large number of people had to pay for the mistake committed by one man. We would like to have good and nice relations with Georgia. Let me repeat it once again. We like and esteem the Georgian people. But I don't want to have any relations with President Saakashvili. I will not have any relationship with him. But if, as a result of democratic processes, the authority in Georgia sooner or later changes, we are open to discussing any issues.